My name is Catherine Farmer and I lead the Habitat Restoration Project on Belle Isle. Initially, wanted to do a tree walk, a tree ID walk. I'm a tree steward and I proposed that I tag 20 trees out here and that was all we were thinking. We weren't, there's nothing about invasive plants, it was just we're going to have a tree walk. People can come out here and they can use a QR code on the, the sign and they could look up more information about the trees. And then I started looking more closely and realized that what I was seeing was English ivy, uh, winter creeper, um, Japanese honeysuckle, and Japanese or Chinese privet, which aren't supposed to be here. And so I proposed that we remove some of them just as a pilot project. So we come in here with hand saws and uh, loppers and we, we can create piles that are 15 feet tall um, in, a, in one day. You know, maybe we were only tackling privet to start out with. Then we went back for the English ivy or the honeysuckle. It's bit by bit by bit by bit. And again, it's because of really wonderful volunteers who work with me that I couldn't do this alone. We're finding walls that have been buried for 50 years or more. This is really exciting for me as somebody who's an architect and interested in architectural history and also just geographic history and people history. There's lots of ways to volunteer in the park. You can volunteer with the trails crew, with Mike and Andrew and help build trails. You can come out here just coming into the park, bring a trash bag, a plastic trash bag, and pick up trash as you're walking through. I think it's really important that people not just use the park for whatever their reason they come out here, whether it's to sunbathe or swim or walk or ride bikes. I think to, to really embrace the island as a whole and to care for it and cherish it. That was part of my inspiration for coming out here and working was the fact that I felt like everyone since the beginning had been using the island and not giving back to the island. 